Hello everyone, yeah, hello everyone, this is Pomum, bringing you part 19 of my uh, Path of Radiance Let's Play. So, we continue directly from stage 2, this is Daybreaks, stage 3. Hey, what's this? What is it, Commander? Oh, here, this is the only place the, in this ruins where I've seen healthy grass growing. You're right, I wonder why. And I found this. Ah, oh, white feathers, so we were right. The heron is around here somewhere. It is possible on that. Hi, right, over here. Uh, what now? Oh, that was Nasir. I thought it was going to be missed for sure. Nasir, what uh, have you found? A heron. Alright, so I, as I said, I know certain characters and I knew Leanne was a character. Uh, that's a girl. <laughs> Nasir, you said that the male heron we met was the only surviving murmur of the race. I believe that to be true. To find another survivor, it's a miracle. All right. Hey, wait, please, I must speak. Uh, come on, wake up. She's fainted dead away. I guess there's nothing I can do but wait for her to come around. I wasn't trying to frighten her. Oh, oh, oh. I find you at last, my beautiful treasure. It's about time you showed your bloated face, you tan ass. Oh, oh, no mistake about it. This is a spectacular work of art. I paid so much to obtain. You still claim ownership, do you? No. Wait, something took this different. This is a, a female? You mean to tell me that yet another lives? How spectacular! Men, bring me that heron, but do her no harm. You'll never have her. I rescued her. <laughs> I rescued her. Again, who will this corporal and wind back never learn? Form up troops. We must protect the heron. Oh, defense map now? Alright. So, my reinforcements. Two people, one of them is Debdam, definitely. The other one, probably the smart thing, is to bring Moerim. Uh, Moerim, pretty solid unit. And if I just give him the... yeah. Like, if I, gri if I give Moerim the... the my band. Where is it? No, 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 no. Where is it? Okay. Thank God. Uh, so really I don't see any point to try and destroy them. I probably want to kill the ones on the left so that I have a better defensive position. Okay. So immediately I have, uh, well, I have Lith only, because the others have to come. So, how about I take care of most of you and get my, my free space. This is a good start for Astrid. I'm going to move everyone to the left. That means that my most fragile units are better off attacking to the left and just running away to the left. You know, the units that I have to the right are the ones that are potentially going to have to take a beating. Oh, big experience. Like, for example, from this guy or from this guy, you know. Okay, that's a lot of swamp. Hmm. This could be big if we hit. 
the critical. Yeah, we get it, we get it. This is big, this is big, because it takes care of a pretty dangerous enemy immediately in here that also has a poisonous weapon. And now I think uh, the rest I can, I can take care of pretty easily. Honestly, my priority might be you. Uh, can, I, can I kill you with a javelin? It's a bit risky. Rather do this with a sword than trade you. One and two. Very good, nice, very nice. That's due to the strength level. If not, I, I couldn't do it. Do I stay there? Yes, I will, I will. I trust. Do I want to lure them even? That's a hand axe. Mm, you're not going to do a lot, so yeah, I can battle a hand axe. Are you... You are on high beer rhythm, so... That's very good. Alright. A bit of a steel axe action. One. Counter. And... Two. There we go. Probably can kill the healer with Nefeni. Yep, even with the slim. Especially with the slim, because the slim is more accurate. That way we don't have to worry about inappropriate, you know, resistance from the enemies. And go here, take care of you immediately, because I don't really care about the rain with Leaf. Lagos are very strong, like very strong. That was a critical. She kind of growls at the enemy before. That's uh, that's cute. Oh really? Well, I can weaken you. Actually, why would I weaken? Thankfully, I'm just going to get the kill with a critical. But why would I weaken for Ike to take the kill? If Ike is, you know, capped. Oh, oh, I understand why I don't double, because I'm carrying... Leang. Can I take, by the way? No. He has to carry Leang, okay. And goodbye. Hammer's gone. The reinforcements for this turn are gone. At least I'm feeling the pressure a little bit now. Uh, I can say I appreciate that. The enemies aren't that strong, you know, I, I still clearly have the advantage, but I am losing health, even on my strong units, so that should mean that even with all the healing I have around, eventually I'm going to run into some trouble. Okay, I, I will go for this, then give the kill to Nefeni. Oscar is uh, very good at feeding kills, that I can say. Actually, the one use Iron Lance, finally. It's an empty. Very good. And a level for Nefeni, level 18. Some defense and rest and HP, okay. Highly defensive levels uh, is kind of what you need now. Okay, going for the javelin. 
No damage. Ah. That's bad, especially because now you don't... Oh, you can reach, okay. No problem then. Please kill at least one of them. I know it's like a 60, but yeah. Yeah. Very good, very good. And the hand axe. Once again, it's going for Void. We still has the advantage thanks to the bio rhythm, so it's always nice to see. And then yeah, I'm going to I'm going to pass on this. Uh, this is just going to be oh okay iron sword. You know what? Come, come! I will battle a, a mark. No problem. Ram Mirmidon. No mercenaries in this game? Probably. Okay, so the axe is the first to come, of course. Oscar. Really? Oscar, come on. Okay, that's more like it. That's more like it. That's what I wanted from you, Oscar. Is it asking that much? <sighs> okay, can you at least do some damage? Because I don't think you double here, so... Okay, at least you hit for 10 damage. Perfect position for an engage attack or something, but that's not happening. And now the slim lens. No. No. The iron lens. Take care of you. Yeah. Lots of experience in here. Seren is for is still blessing us. Yeah. I feel a bit bad about using Lonesrod against, you know. Someone that is in a cavalry, so even though it would be a good idea, let's go for the steel. And we get a level up, level 19 with magic. Come on. Why? Nice. Is it the moment for a physic or do I yes? Ooh, three cavalries from the back. Iron lands, iron lands, iron lands. Uh, oh no no no! I did I I thought this was Mia for some reason. Okay, you don't reach. You don't exactly reach, but. I think this is the most helpful thing you can do right now. I'm going to have you two ahead. Really? That was like a 96. Okay. Pretty scary that I'm missing those. Where do you reach? Reach pretty far. You reach pretty far. Okay. I need to weaken in some way, so at least I'm doing this. It's a level for void um, skill luck. Okay, those are needed, so I'm not complaining. I think this is. Oh, 
Okay, Oscar. That's a 74, I know. No, I could use the killer, but you don't need it. You don't need it. You don't need it. You can do it like this. See? And level 18 with some speed. Okay. Not half bad. Well, I, I wouldn't do that because... It's Muarim taking care of you. Yeah, as I said, Lagus slightly broken. Then my band seems to just be. Okay. Mm, oof. That's actually close. Uh, let's use the Polax. Uh, I don't get a lot of opportunities. Okay, so is Oscar okay? Should be fine. I am going to put Mist like in a position where she can heal next turn, but he should be fine. Okay, I'd like to take care of a lot of people here. You know the mages are probably the least scary of them all, so take care of the of the archer. That's a longbow too, yeah, so. That's a longbow. Then I think I go down, right? It's closer to the enemy, but I'm also safe from you. And Okay, what do you prefer to do here? Yeah, we're going we're going to take care of the soldier and the mage, I think. And that way mm, that way what? Yeah, that way the other guy suicides on any of uh, of the two here. Heal or Soren. Okay, might as well give her, you know, the opportunity to get a 3% critical. Adept on Mia would probably be very good because she doubles a lot, so that's a lot of chances to get it. Yeah. Somehow I knew that was going to happen. Just talking about Adept, so it appears when you when you don't need it the most. Oh, one square too far away. All right. That has to be a killer lens. Not playing a wrong here. Very good. There goes the bow. Nice. Two enemies. <laughs> Dep them. Do realize that, yeah, in other characters I have invested some experience and all that. This is a character that got handed out to me for free last chapter. And still most of the enemies get one rounded and do almost absolutely nothing to him. So I think I'm being pretty fair when I say the enemy strength in this game is kind of low. Yes, yes, slightly low, you know. Uh, who's hurt? You're actually kind of hurt. 
Okay. How are we looking? Turn seven. One. I think I I just blocked something. Well, that's some sort of practice. Oh, I'm hurt. I'm hurt. Um, shouldn't matter because I have Soren to heal. And thankfully, there's no ambush reinforcements in this game. The, the reinforcements meant to the convoy. The reinforcements seem to just appear at the end of the turn. Okay, how much? A lot. <laughs> the whole health. Perfect. Okay, Boyd. Is Boyd the one that's closest to a level? To a... That's 30, that's 61, okay. Okay, well, actually, you don't really do that well. Let's give it to Void. Void kind of deserves the level more than you, Oscar, because you have everything going on for you. You have the mounds, you have my, my slight preference at the very beginning, but your levels just haven't been that good. 15 strength and 11 is... Uh, 15 speed and 11 strength. It's just low. So yeah, I'll keep doing this. Mm, could heal. Don't think I will. Your face. Turn 10. Okay. Well, that wasn't the most complicated defense map I've ever played, but it, it was a nice challenge. Like, uh, there was at least something to be done there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> what vexation wretches. I am over my wretches. I can't believe I'm saying this, but there's another white horn. Retreat, leave them their place. Okay, so he actually gives up uh, catching Leanne. He just focuses on Raison, that makes sense. Dropping Leanne in the circle. Bless. Yuktanas has escaped. Ike, uh, perhaps trying to fight with that heron on your back. It's not the wisest of ideas. Why don't we take her to the Apostle before moving on? We've finally got Yuktanas on the run. I don't intend to stop until we've captured or killed that monster. I understand, but shouldn't we at least let someone else carry that her? Truth be told, she's unbelievably light. I barely know she's there. Is is that so? I think she was, uh, I'd say, about half as much as missed. Oh, wow, I'm surprised. I, I'll i bet you are. What are you grinning about, boys? Oh, nothing. I'm just amazed. Did you know you're two times heavier than she is? I'm glad I don't have to carry you around. I'd be, it would be like wearing an extra suit of armor. You you pig, you're the worst. Holy shit. <laughs> Alright, maybe I exaggerated a bit. But she's still lighter than you. Well, what do you expect? She's a bear. That show to Boyd was absolutely necessary. Uh, you know, absolutely integral to the story. The story couldn't have been told without that. Commander, if this battle is going to continue, I think we should get more reinforcements. More? I don't know who to bring at this point. Uh, but yeah, we continue, obviously. We continue, because this is a stage four. This has to be the last one. I don't think they are going to put me to, through a five stage thing and this is the end of the map, this structure. I did guess correctly, I think, that this is the place where you can let loose the... the I don't know how they called it, something like Draglar uh, magic. Well, within those humans camp, cost me time, but 
We almost made it to the altar. Raison, are you well? Uh, Tivar, how did you... Eloci told us everything. Oh, uh, allow me to apologize. Left on my own without a word to you, and this is what happened. As long as you're unharmed, all is well. Let's go home. Please, give me a little time. I cannot allow these humans to remain in the forest. I understand why, how you feel, but we are completely outnumbered. Let us wait for another day. Once I stand at the Atlar, I can take care of them. Every one of them. You... You can't mean... Are you thinking of using the forbidden magic? Yes. I will send those monsters, the dirge of ruin. Are you mad? You mustn't. I can't allow it. With permission or without, I do what I must. It is retribution for genocide. Retribution for this forest. Reason? You must not let yourself be ruled by despair. Each member of the Heron tribe is an embodiment of balance. Do this, and you warp your very existence. That is what they all said. My family, my tribe, and then they died. The humans were drunk with joy. They laughed. They sang. And then they slaughtered us like livestock. My mother, my brother, my elder sister, even my infant sister, Leanne. Oh. All killed in a single night. Reason? I know. This thing I intend to do brings dishonor to my house. And yet I cannot forgive. And their past actions weren't enough. Now they violate the sanctity of the forest without a trace of regret. Of course, humans. I will never forgive them. Do you think we understand that? That's right. There's reason. There's no need for you to forget your honor based on the likes of them. The tragedy of the herons, the horror and pain of that night, lives on in all of us. Let's return to Poanesis and think of a plan. You're right. This will not stand. The full power of the Hawk Nation is behind you. The humans will pay. As you wish. Surprising. Surprising. I didn't think Raison at this point could be reasoned with, but it seems like he does, you know, the nature of the herons as creatures of balance and the opinion of the hawk tribe does matter to him. And I, I honestly think that's refreshing because when you see a character behaving stupidly, it feels bad. Enough already. Lay down your arms and surrender. We will let you live. No, never. I'm, I'm not giving up. I'm not finished yet. Out of my way, penniless wretches. Your very existence is an insult to all that is beautiful. All you really want is my wealth and beauty. Miserable curse, you reek of poverty and envy. Oh, but I understand your emotions. Yes, I do. How could you sad vagabonds not want to be me? That's... The last thing in the world. Silence! I am not one to be daunted by mean beggars such as you. <laughs> in the name of the goddess, I, Oliver, Duke of Tanis, will smite your hideous evil. Uh, <laughs> look, at the, look at the face of Nike. Two arms, two arms! Defend me with all the strength you both says. Oh, bring me the little bird that blue heart loud is carrying while you are at it. Oh, please. Okay, can we like here they come? Combat formation everyone. Okay. So Oliver with a Nosferatu, light magic. Okay, it makes sense. Uh light magic when it is present. I think they said the light magic light magic beats other magics. So that could be nice. Very slow. Not a lot of defense. Not a lot of magic. Yes, a lot of luck. And a lot of resistance. Allows the wielder to use light magic. The level appears uh, next to the staff. What? Level appears next to the staff. Oh, so 
your staff rank is your light magic rank. Okay, that's interesting. Then Reese probably has better offensive potential that I, than I gave him credit for. This guy is so bad. You know? Yeah, he... Unless I'm mistaken, he is very slow, he doesn't have a lot of defense, he should just get destroyed. Okay, not for to say rank. So, it being dropped doesn't mean a lot. But he does have people to protect him, so... A meteor. Ooh, okay, immediate target for Marcia. Uh, in fact, can I, I can't change position, okay, uh, well, Meteor, Adept, I, I did say Adept would be very good on Mia, so, you know, the moment you say it, and what is it, a Seize, a Kill Map, A defeat boss, yeah. A defeat boss. Okay, so I could bring two more people. I really don't know who's helpful in here, so I'm just going to pass because I don't want to get anyone killed. As cool as it is to have a, a reinforcement mechanic and working for you, I mean. I'm going to pass. Ooh. Nice Pegasus Knight. The first one we face, maybe? I think it's been all Wyverns until now. It does look like Benyon is the... You know, your typical... Okay, okay. This is... It's trees. There are those typical places where you can't stand on, so... Unless I'm able to kill you. No, I think I'm going to have to take a meteor to the face. Before I can do anything about you. Okay, yeah. Sure looks that way, so... Meteor can be dropped, by the way. It's fire magic, uh, I'm guessing. Not the best way to... N not the best place to face a Meteor. But I don't really have armors or anything that suffers excessively against it, so yeah. Skill and speed. The reduction of experience once you promote isn't that big. To be honest. Long range fire magic C rank. Difficult to master can strike enemies from afar. And it's effective against beasts. Okay. Then I think it's pretty clear what we must do. Uh, our way to put our Lagus in a safe position is to critical. To have them advance and you know because they are advancing, try and kill some people. Because if they get hit by a super effective meteor, that kind of sounds like trouble. Okay, here's the Stilax. This is a heavy hit, so yeah, it would be nice to dodge it. And we did dodge it. All right, all right, all right, all right. Looking good, looking good. Not gonna lie. Uh, yeah, the meteor is a problem, but we have our ways. A Lombo would be very good in here, too. And I actually have... I actually have the rank to use a Lombo because I leveled, but I didn't bring one. Could have been a very beautiful way of taking care of you. 
Well, anyway. Yeah. Good. So, coming for the still lands. Can't blame you, really. You come for Yil. Yes. Okay. Or the characters that don't double. Makes sense. Okay, this is a big map. Full of enemies. Not that easy. I hope they don't get reinforcements. This is a heavy spear, by the way. Uh, don't care. I did see it. Uh, yes, don't care because I don't have armors. <laughs> okay. Got some experience out of it too. A swamp. All right. We are okay. I think. I can chip at the Polax <laughs> just for fun. He's not going to hit me. I have too much dodge. I mean, a 28 can hit any day, but even after that, I would survive the. Oh, that's a weapon rank. I want to stay there. Because next I want to attack here. Yeah, that's exactly what... Oof. Okay. Could have traded you wind. I didn't realize the, the Pegasus was in range. Having to do this every turn to check ranges is a bit annoying. Not much else I can do. And taking care of all the enemies back here seems like a pretty big win. Good thing that they have Ike carrying the Heron because I don't know, it yes. It makes this map a lot more. You know, it's really clear what you have to do. And Ike at this point is normally one of your strongest units. So the penalty is harsh on him, but also not harsh enough that you feel it's unfair. So I don't know, I, I really like the idea. Ooh, Slim. My name is... And there we go. Okay, okay. And 28, 24, 23 out of... 35. Oof, not worth. Almost messed it up there. Although a worth could be useful because I'm in range of the meteor. Actually, uh, I'm lucky that I put my beasts down there because I wasn't noticing at all the danger depth down. Might be that. Because of the meteor. Please, they've done. You have to dodge a bit. Okay. That might be a, a key dodge to get in here because. Okay, you go for lift. The paladin will probably prefer they've done because he has weapon advantage and. Also, maybe even less defense than Leaf. That I don't know. They, they are around the, the same amount. Yeah, he prefers them. Um, open advantage, he's... Yeah, he's hitting. Doesn't double, right? Doesn't double. Can I take 19 from a Meteor? Uh, you preferred going for Void. Interesting choice. Didn't expect that. Well, 
Aaron Lance coming for Soren, as I said, uh, this was probably my biggest mistake. I could have traded uh, an Elwynd and I would have killed here. I don't double. That still did a lot more than expected. But now I can kill here and I can take care of the Meteor and we are we're really safe. <laughs> I even get an Adept Critical. So, you know, just in case. You know, the critical that if you dodge would be accompanied by two more hits. Sorry, who can come here? You! Seven movement on the Halberdier. Uh, six movement on the General. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This normal? Well. Anyway. I don't care. Because I attack and I can go down. So I can be safe. Meteor won't counter. So gimme. Oh, it wasn't droppable. Okay. Well. Uh, I don't think there's danger. That was a bit stupid anyway. Goes for Marcia. Actually a, a good strategy here. Marcia probably kills. And you get killed. Uh, 22 times 2. Pretty humiliating, and I think the only one in range of the flyer is actually Lith. So the flyer is also going to get killed here. And I get some strength, skill, speed, you know, yes. Normal Lagusa stuff. It's true, Lith can't be used for the whole battle, like there's a point where she becomes, you know, human form, but even so. There's those Lagus stones that I'm pretty sure. Oh, please don't become red. Because I'm not well positioned for this. Uh, well, no, Lith has a lot of movement. I think I could still. Uh -huh, they are still going at it over here. Shall we go around? I suppose so. Two human armies bashing one another's brains out. I wonder what they are after. Oh. There's that sound again. Rayson, are you doing that? No, I suppose not. The forest is whispering something. Yeah. Uh -huh. Into arm, Prince Rayson, look there. Huh? Huh? The blue heart human is carrying something on his back. No, it, it can't be. Is that another heron? But that's not. I think some of the humans might be fighting to protect the heron. It's against my nature, but we shall aid them. Yanav, Ulki, to me. Right. Yes, sir. Tomar, please, allow me to go with you. If you forswear the forbidden magic, you may come. Agreed. Ooh. Big reinforcements. Okay, so if you have trouble with the meteor, you get this fucking pack of guys. Uh, who seem to be killable. You know, I actually think we should just peer rush into the... Mm. Short spear, short spear, short spear. I actually think this might be just a hope 
might be choking hard on Copium here, but I, I think... Uh, I think these guys aren't going to move, the short spears. So I think I just need to get all the people I can close to Oliver. So that I, so that I can reap the benefits right now. So for example, I can do this. I can do this and then I can take and drop with many of them. The thing is, because I keep rescuing someone, he can't be rescued. Another good design decision by this map. But uh, it's not going to stop me. I'm pretty sure I can still... No. Drop. Pretty sure I can still escape with no problem. I mean, I could also take care of them, but... Running seems... More, more appropriate and more story-like. Okay, you don't kill. You almost do, however. Really, Tiburn, you go for the bows. You saw a lot of bows and you thought, yeah, th this is a good idea. And now I feel like I'm going to have to help. Or I can just... Take care of Oliver this turn. Let's do that instead. Yep. I'm going to kill you with Marcia, Oliver. I'm going to kill you with Marcia. You probably have a combat code with uh with Rayson or something, but I don't care. I don't care. I think I'm just going to go for the kill. That's a level up for Soren, level 5. 33. Nice. Um, can I talk to you? Okay. We're going to check if we can talk. You know, let's prioritize. I can show, so... No, no talking. No talking. Well, then I think aside from doing this to get a bit of experience, that's going to be the end of it. I didn't even check, but I think Oliver has to get one rounded. Ooh, 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 ooh. Okay, okay, okay. It's not that easy. Put here. Right, that's a more or less solid start. I know he has Nosferatu. Uh, but because I'm so inaccurate, if there's a moment to do this, it's the start. Listen to me, you boars. You cannot possibly understand the pursuit of beauty. You're savages. You are a blight on the world and you must die. Okay. Now, this Nosferatu doesn't really matter because he doesn't get the health back. But this second axe hit, yes, yes, perfectly calculated, perfectly calculated. Nosferatu, I know it's supposed to, you know, break the game, yada yada, but okay, you should be able to do some more damage here, and then I can go for a very accurate hit with a sword. 12, you recover 6. Oh, you recover the whole damage you do? Okay. Then Nosferatu is very strong in this game. Very strong. I didn't think it would be a full heal. I thought it was going to be half 
for sure. But yeah, that's that's big. That's big then. Uh, then you're just an annoying guy. Uh, not this one, but I, I would like to give a kill to you. Well, I could also go for this and it would be the end, but giving it to Muarim of all people, not my thing. Uh, this, this has to be the way, actually, because you only recovered two. So let's see if I can feed you a kill. Astrid, and if I can't, then at least I try it. Okay. We can down to 15. Mm. Still is 64. Lagus is 69. Lagus is 69. Okay, please hit. All right. If not, I'm not sure I was able to get to uh, that 20 experience, you know. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Why do you? Level 20 and some. What? Level 20 and some. Okay, now I'm not going to promote you because I I can just get more levels apparently. Up the speed, by the way. Interesting. Um, well, so Ulki, by the way, didn't look at them. Yanaf has insight. Increases hit, increases dodge, uh, Raison, and this unit the ability to perform a chant that lets allied units move again and restores HP to a unit in an adjacent space. Double skill set there, Empty Barn, a level 18 hawk with Savior, eliminates skill and speed penalties when carrying. That's very big. And cancel. In certain conditions, nullifies enemy attacks. Holy shit. Uh, but we don't want to see them in action now. We just want to get out of here. So the safest way, I think, is this. 60, 65 actually. La Guzlans. La Guzlans. Because Oliver is probably a pig lagos or something. Oh! Ah! I cannot fall here. I cannot be such a loss to beauty. Yeah. Finally. Fucking Oliver. Skill speed, different res. Ooh. Beautiful level. Level 5 promoted already, I have. Go to the convoy, and that's the end of the map. It's you. And you're back. Who is it you carry? Oh, the, the girl. I think she may be somebody you know, but... Uh, my brother? Do I read my brother there? Well. Uh huh, uh huh. Where's this possible? How did you survive all this time? Uh, Leon, do you know who I am? That's right, you remember my name. Have you been here by yourself for all these years? The forest protected her. It kept her asleep for so long. There's no way to express my gratitude. 
You there, Bjork. Me. I am Tibar, king of Phoenicius. Since the loss of their homeland, the Serenus royal family has been under my guardianship. Who are you, and why do you aid the Herons? My name is Ike. I am commander of the Grill mercenaries. I am under orders of the Empress, the Apostle Senaki, to protect the Herons. And the Empress of this country wants to protect the Herons? <laughs> That's an interesting tale. The Herons were blamed for the assassination of the last Empress. They were massacred on her say. And now her ancestor wants to help them? Touching. No, that's ancestor, descendant, but okay. The Empress Senaki knows that the Herons are not murderers, and now she's trying to atone for the crimes of her people. N no, I cannot believe that. Pathetic apologies and half baked platitudes are easily spoken. Humans burn Serenus Forest. They killed my family. I cannot trust I cannot trust one who allies himself with them. Please, withhold judgment until you speak with the Apostle. She's waiting at the forest's edge. The the Apostle is here. Now this is a big event like <laughs> there's like four royals in here uh and two of them are human and two are lagos so big event so you are the apostle i am i'm Sorry. I am ignorant as to what words of contrition will be appropriate to one of the Heron tribe. Yet I stand before you as a representative of my people. From the depths of my heart, I apologize to you. I am sorry, so truly sorry. Empress Sanaki, what are you doing? You are the apostle, you cannot bend your knee to another. Peace. Let her speak her heart. I... I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Huh? Leanne? You... What is it you want? Are you telling me to stand? You... Leanne. Leanne, you cannot ask me to forgive them. You you were asleep. You don't know what these humans did to us. You know? That's right. Everyone is gone. That's why I cannot release my hatred. This is weird to read through, but I obviously can't pronounce any of this, so... I understand. If that is how you feel. Postal Sanaki, we accept your apology. You may not be able to release our hatred of, of, of Bjork, but you need not let the fate of Serenus Forest trouble you any longer. You are absolved of that gift. Thank you. That was well done. Yes. Hello, Dyke. What will happen now? Her own sibling said there would be some sort of ceremony. But I don't know what that entails. You, Dark. Bjork mercenaries. Translation wants all of you to come to the Serenus altar. The princess of Princess Crimea and the Apostle is also requested. Altar. Let's come with me, it's this way. Empress Sanaki, Commander Syngron, let us go. Very well. Let us hurry, Ike. Oh, right. Right. Cinematic.
if the volume is absurdly low, I will. All right. the dub is close to the mother's song okay okay this is I said their mother could be a lagoon. Forest. I'm thinking. Returned. She could be a heron. Maybe not royalty because only royalty has uh, white wings and uh, blonde hair, and she definitely has like purple hair or so. But yeah, that was excellent. It's, it's so beautiful. Uh, Serena's forest, beloved of the goddess, is alive once more. You spoke so well earlier, Empress Anaki. You fill my heart with pride. Uh, here now, none of that. This is no place for tears. I'm, I'm sorry, I'm just so happy. <laughs> Sigrun is <laughs> like Sanaki's mother. <laughs> ah, excellent. The gap between Lagos and Berg has been bridged. I think this may be enough. What do you mean this may be enough? What's wrong, sorry? Uh, you look so grim. What are you looking at? It's nothing. Nothing at all. Wait, sorry. Uh, what in the world is wrong with him? Yeah. Um, okay. So that was the end of a four part incredibly well written incredibly well you know gameplay integrated uh succession of maps i don't know if I, I can even call it a chapter it is apparently a chapter chapter 17 day breaks has to be one of the most memorable in this in this game if i know anything about the game design uh this is set up to be memorable and yeah as nasir so so clearly put it, the, the gap between Bjork and Lagus seems to have been bridged. But this, you know, Anis, everyone feels about Soren, is being referenced more and more and more and more. So I think we're going to play a bit more into that in the future. Well, uh, yeah, as I said, gameplay wise, Gameplay-wise, I feel like if the enemies were stronger, the map design would shine so much. So I really hope that hard mode for Path of Radiance is uh, challenging enough for me to, you know, feel like this is a game worth replaying and just not, you know, that you can't just steamroll it with uh, Ike and, I don't know, Marcia, Jill. It seems to me like there are certain units that are so strong under, especially after you boost them with uh, bonus experience that you can destroy the game with them. Let's hope hard mode is a bit more difficult than that. I'm already looking at hard mode because this is a game to be a game to be replayed for sure, for sure. And I can't really say it's one of my favorite games due to especially how slow it plays at times. You know, all the animations, the the UI, you know. But man, is the story good. Like the story. The story 
is like the best written in this series. Clearly, clearly, there's not even a contest. Not even a contest. Uh, the amount of things happening of historical background of meaning in each and every of the character's actions. There's, character I, th there's characters in this game I haven't even used. I haven't even gotten to look at... Just look at the random NPC that told me about Oliver's situation and the troops because his parents are still, uh, you know, feeling guilty about the massacre in, in Serenes. That motherfucking character has better, like, ten times more writing than Raphael. It's, it's very good. It's very well written, it's very well structured, and I can't wait to see where it goes from here, because I would... I would say with a lot of confidence that this probably marks the end of the Benion part of the story. And from this point on, as we have fulfilled our promise with Sanaki and we have helped her, you know, build a better relation with the Lagus, and then she is going to aid us to go against Dain. And so how is that going to be framed and how is that going to go? We'll have to see in the next part. But for now, this has been Pomum. If you liked, then consider liking, subscribing, leaving a comment. Uh, and I will see you in the next one. Yeah. Bye.